20 years ago, I was involved in a film called John Frickett. Now it's been released with critical acclaim, the directors and myself have decided to put together a short film consisting of interviews, outtakes and also shots from the film to produce this one-off programme called The Making of John Frickett. <laughs> We now have a world exclusive. We are live on the set of John Frigate with The Cheese. Co-writer, co-producer, co-director, actor, the list is endless. Mr. The Cheese. What can I say? I don't know. <laughs> I'm with Ross Simons today, one of the actors in the new production of John Frigate. Good morning, Ross. Hi, thanks for having me. So what is the general plot of John Frigate? Well, Obviously my contract says I can't say too much about it, but uh, I'm sure if you see it you'll, uh, you'll be pretty impressed. Hofmeister's gas actually worked. Dr Hofmeister's remarkable memory-erasing gas. Memory-erasing gas? Who are you, Mr Fucking Exposition? <laughs> doesn't make things. Thank you, Ross Simons. Thank you. Still no luck with John Frigger, but hey, we're here with Mr Adam Jackson, who is one of the extras in the John Frigger film. So, Adam, while the writers and producers aren't around, how was it working with him? Um, Mr. Dor Dennis, very creative. I found that some of his ideas were impeccable. His uh, areas of photography knew no bounds of creativity. Austin Charlesworth, um I think I'll leave it at that really. Just changing the subject slightly, I know it's a Norwich City poster on your wall. Soon they'll win the cup! Yeah, right. Yes, yeah, so I think I have a wank now, actually. We're now with Richard Dordanis in the writer's corner. So, Richard, what was the inspiration for the film? When I was younger, we had this uh, series of comics called Battle Action, very, uh, very inspirational comics. I met Austin Charlesworth, uh, what? Two months ago, I showed him the comics and he thought, you know, it's a esoterical example of uh, what went wrong with the uh, 20th century, sometime around 1950. Well, the, what we came up with in the end was uh, John Frigate. Which again, I think, is something poignant for this generation to look at. Everything we used is, in fact, our own ideas and, um, you know, we haven't stolen any from anybody. A magnum! Quite a cannon for a woman to be packing. Yes, and I know whose head I'd like to blow off with it. Adaption, maybe. No, no, no. I, I, I think it'd be wrong to say adaption. They've disappeared! Um, interpretation, possibly. But no, not adaption. No. What the... Oh, too late, English pig dog. Oh. Try some of her gas. Is this your first major film? Well, it's my first uh, project of this size, yes, but I like to think I've been involved on other major projects. Um, a couple of years ago I was involved in... A An attack of the 50-foot twat. So I played the role of the clitoris. Talking to Mr Charlesworth earlier, and he's saying he's moving into sort of more family comedy area. Can you envisage yourself staying in the uh, action? Yes, yes, I'd like to stay in the action thing. I, I believe Austin thinks that it's action's had its day, but... Action's had its day. Then he does like children a lot, and... Uh, I've always been rather wary of people like that. Right, we're moving swiftly away from children now. We might move on to the actual star of the show, John Frigate, if we can find him. I'm sure he's around the uh, set somewhere. Well, I do believe he's in his trailer entertaining the actress that plays Miss Mittens at the minute. Um, a bit of an on-set relationship that I hope the newspapers will pick off on. But, um, well, it's just, uh, just fun, really. I mean, working with such good actors. Very good film, actually. We're working with such a wonderful cast. and It was an opportunity I couldn't really refuse. Best film I've ever been an extra in, I would say. Uh, in such a good plot. Well, it's just such a fun project to be working on. Well, yeah. thank you, Mr. Dodanis. Much appreciated. No, no, it's a pleasure. So we look pleasure. forward to seeing a film when it comes out. Oh, good. Stay tuned for interviews, outtakes and secrets. Thank you.